Well, this is my uh, alcohol stove that I made. It's just basically a old sterno can I poked the holes using a knife. It's a penny stove. It's actually the, the nickname of a penny stove. This is heavy duty aluminum foil. I uh, folded three times and I put two uh, welding rods bent over at the same shape. And that's my stand. And then this is my shroud for wind. And uh, there's basically a cup of water here. Stainless steel cup of water goes right on top of that. And I'm just going to boil up some water, fire this thing up, and see. Uh, oh, shit, I got to. One thing you got to do with a alcohol stove is just. You should prime it. Let's see if that works. Gets uh Now, alcohol burns very, oh, very hot. <laughs> alcohol burns, uh, you can see it dissipating off the top, but um, it burns in the daytime, you can't see it. Let's put it that way. Very difficult to see. I can feel it's burning, it's hot. But, uh, all right, well, let me get back to you in a little while. I'll heat this water up. I'll just probably show it to you boiling and everything. And that's how it sits on top of my stand. And that's an 18 ounce, uh, stainless steel pot put it right back okay so anyway there now it's boiling that's about I'm about 30 seconds later 20 seconds later and I was told to put this ramen in noodle uh, the the packet in first supposedly I guess Tinny said that I always just dump it in but we'll try it that way and uh, start adding get that get that going uh, boiling it is boiling and then you just drop your uh, your ramen noodles. I like, I like the chicken. I can't stand that shrimp and that beef flavor, but that's that. Uh, I just put little blocks in. You see it boiling around it. I'm gonna let that cook and uh, I'm gonna chow down on that. Also, I brought some seeds, I brought some uh, chili, beef, and mac. Chili, mac, and beef. And uh, I never had a mountain house, but that's good till 2015. That's a good dehydrated meal. And uh, some creamers in there. I got another top ramen. I got some fruit cup in a can. I got coffee. And uh, you know, there's a lot of things you can do when it comes to uh, you know, hiking and convenience and survival and you know that's what this is all about um you know getting out there and having your bag ready to go when it comes down and uh and it's also about enjoying yourself you know this is what we do this is what we like this is what's fun for us and uh you know i need to be more active in my part but uh i do what i can you know and uh it's fun choose some seeds Sit by a beautiful lake right there. I don't know if you guys can see how that's my little spot right here. See the water? I mean, it's beautiful coming off the lake. And, uh, you know, sitting here eating ramen. Oop. Oh, this is boiling. <laughs> and, uh, like I said, check out survivalistboards.com. Check out Mini Bull Design. Check out uh, Josi Josiah521. And, uh, there's a couple other guys. I'll mention them later. Uh, and have a good day. Bye-bye.